Welcome back. Now in this video we want to discuss where you can commonly find HTML or where it might show up in things that you are doing on a regular basis. And we've already taken a look at WordPress. We've seen that HTML will show up inside of the text editor. If you've ever moved a YouTube video onto a web page, you'll notice that there's an embed code and you'll see that HTML code will show up when you're doing this. If you work with PayPal buttons to put on a page, you have probably seen HTML code as you're looking at right here. If you have taken an autoresponder code in order to put onto your site in order to have an opt-in box, you have used HTML code. If you are a regular user of an affiliate network, you'll notice in order to place the product on your page with an image, you'll need to use a specific code and that code will have your and that code will be HTML and you'll recognize the code here. If you are a podcaster and you have looked to place embed code on your site, you have used HTML code as it's been given to you by Apple. HTML also determines the file structure when you are uploading different items to be displayed on your site. You'll see a number of site files, you'll see the HTML extension as well as an index file that's an indication that HTML is being used. And as we have been editing a page, as we've been discussing since the beginning of this course, we are using HTML. Okay, so with that, thanks, and I will see you in another video.